Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'm gonna to be showing you how to make one of my newest favorite salads. It's super quick and easy, so let's get started. Just a quick run through of what you're gonna need. Um, first off, lettuce, of course, or whatever other greens you might wanna add in. And then some cherry tomatoes. And next, the most important ingredient, the shredded rotisserie chicken. I found mine at Walmart. This one is really good. It's pre-seasoned and all shredded up and cooked for you, so it's ready to go. And then one onion. I do typically like to use a red onion. That is my favorite with this salad. However, I didn't have one on hand, so we went with what we had. <laughs> um, and then you saw a little bit of cheese, shredded cheese, whatever you prefer, salt, pepper, and our dressings, which is ranch. The Marzetti's is my absolute favorite and balsamic reduction. Be sure it's the reduction and not the vinaigrette because the reduction is what's gonna give you that little bit of sweetness. And last is some sunflower seeds, which is just gonna give it a little bit of a crunch. Um, I love using those versus croutons, a little bit of a healthier option, but of course you can use croutons as well. Now I'm just gonna take out my lettuce and pick out the ends that I don't like, a little bit of brown spots, throw those ones off to the side. And I will be right back. I'm gonna go wash these up. Okay, and after I washed up my lettuce nice and good, I'm just dabbing off the excess water, and then I'm gonna get ready to um, chop it all up. Again, as I mentioned, you can buy the bagged lettuce or whatever other greens you want. Um, it will definitely make this salad even that much quicker and easier for you, but this is just what I happen to have in the house, so I am gonna use it up. Okay, so our lettuce is all chopped up and we're ready to move on to the next step in this salad. However, I am gonna quick clean up my space. Um, that was something my mom taught me from young is to clean as you go. It makes things a lot easier. Alrighty, moving on to the onion. I'm gonna dice up my onion. Um, probably only gonna use about half of the onion in this salad and I'll just save the other half for something else this week. But like I mentioned earlier, I would highly recommend using a red onion, um, more common for salads in general, but it just tastes so much better with this specific salad. But again, this is just what I happen to have in the house, so we're gonna use this today instead. Okay, our onion is added in. Now we're just gonna move right on to the cherry tomatoes. These I'm just gonna slice right down the middle once and throw right on top. Um, I am gonna try to keep those face up when I put them on the actual salad, just because then when I add on the salt and pepper, it's more apt to stick to the tomatoes. Once we have those tomatoes sliced and placed on top, like I mentioned, we're just gonna add a little salt and pepper to taste. Mm -hmm. 
Now we're ready to add in the best part of this salad, in my opinion, um, the rotisserie chicken, which there are some larger pieces in this container. So I'm just gonna take those out and kind of slice them up before I add them in the salad. And like I said, I found mine at Walmart. So this specific kind is pre-seasoned. If you do find some rotisserie chicken or shred up your own, you might wanna add some additional seasoning just for flavor. And of course, every salad needs a little bit of cheese, so I'm gonna sprinkle on some shredded pepper jack. And then after that, I'm gonna add on my sunflower seeds, which I think you can never have enough of, so overdo on those for sure. And then the ranch. And last but not least, your balsamic reduction, which again, I think you can overdo on this as well because it just adds so much good flavor to the salad. So there we go guys, we have everything in the salad bowl. Now all that's left to do is toss it up. And of course, most importantly, enjoy. Thank you so much for watching and be sure to hit the subscribe button so I can keep sharing my new and latest favorite recipes and very soon our bathroom makeover.